Hi all. Today I would like to explain um, how we can convert this ZUP animation into YUP, uh, especially when you are working for uh, uh, Unreal as well as Unity or any other uh, game engine or maybe you want to convert this animation to uh, Maya or Blender some way. So overall basically I got uh, this package from uh, Unreal Marketplace which is free one. So when you add this one you can see this is the animation which I want to convert from Unreal to Unity. So in that case this is only an example basically you can use any of the other uh, actually if you create any your own animation which is created for ZUP and finally you want to convert it into YUP. Uh, what is the easiest way? Uh, which is was uh, there might be different ways also I found one of the way so that is a that is a thing I just want to explain you so so first of all what I need is I need to export this animation this is the animation uh, to export this animation we will just right click over here asset actions export so which will export it as a anim run okay this is the animation file which I got it like this so when you want to import and see inside unity see uh, along with the animation we need to export the mesh of elef elephant so this is the mesh so this one also I need to export this asset actions export so here I exported already as a SK elephant FBX so I got these two FBX one is run animation and one is elephant animation you can do all the animations together as a bulk also but I just want to showcase you what is the issue we will get when you import it into unity or in Maya or any other engine so now these two these two are the animations so I am just copying these two copy and I'm taking these animations inside assets folder okay now when I click on the model itself the model shows in s not in a proper view so when you drag and drop into the scene you can see this is the character but the problem is on the rotation that means on the transform you can see the rotation is minus 90 so when you add the animation maybe I will create an animation controller for this and attach it to the elephant and I will add an animation to it and when I play this animation the animation goes in a different direction it is it is not proper so even in the animation if I keep it on the loop okay and I play see this is the animation in a different direction so whereas the programmer need this has to come in a proper way when you add it into the scene so when I manually adjust it into zero and play this goes uh, the, by default it looks really bad that means it goes in a different direction but in the play mode it is improper but this is also not good so to fix this the best way is I will show you one thing I'll just drag and drop this elephant FBX and by default this is settings is in Y up okay and maybe I can keep it in a 30 but there is no animation in this no problem so right now if you see it looks fine in inside Maya but the problem is when I select this you can see there is a minus 90 this is a minus 90 so now what I need is I need to get this values into the zero so how we can do it the best way is first thing is I I don't want I want this mesh to be duplicated and reskin it so what I am doing is select this LOD if you want zero you can uh, zero is the highest value of the mesh one is lowest that means the mesh count is different so if I duplicate the zero control D you will get the mesh count is small so I can I want this has to be as a skinned mesh so for this I can select this one and unparent it so when you unparent it it comes out like this so just remove the skinning part that means there is no skinning but only we just need to unlock this selected and now I just need to minus 90 to get back to the center of the position now what I need is I need to skin this to 
the skeleton properly so what I will do is I will unparent this root also okay and select this mesh and this root go to the rigging skin bind skin so this is a default skin I am I didn't change anything this is everything is reset to default now what I will do is I will select the LOD 0 and LOD 2 and skin copy skin weights so that I can copy the skin weights from this to this so now I don't want this group entire thing which is the old one so what I will do is I will select these two and create a group okay and I want the same name so what I will do is I will just copy this name and delete this group and rename this group as same so now I have the LOD of highest quality LOD as well as the root okay so now I will export this as SK elephant export all so now I will export into the same position I will replace this I will replace this SK elephant FPX now if you come back to unity you can see this comes automatically in a correct position if you select the model also you can see the model shows in a proper direction and when you play the animation it shows in a proper animation so the basic thing is animation when you export you don't need to change the animation as a Y up so the best thing is you don't need to re-export all the animations you can export animations from Unreal to Unity or Unreal to Maya or any other th thing but you need to export the model you need to re-rig the model into the different direction and export hope this will work and but one more thing when you are when you do this one here it looks fine but if you want to see the root the root shows minus 90 but I hope this doesn't make any proper problem for you uh, because we the animation always shows into that direction and everything looks fine hope this uh, this will help to others thanks